हेलो एवरीवन इन दिस वीडियो विल डिस्कस अबाउट नेस्टेड फॉर लूप इन सी प्रोग्रामिंग अ लूप विद इन अनदर लूप इज कॉल्ड नेस्टेड लूप नेस्टेड लूप मींस अ लूप स्टेटमेंट इन साइड अनदर लूप स्टेटमेंट दैट्स व्हाई नेस्टेड लूप आर आल्सो कॉल्ड एज लूप इन साइड लूप वी कैन डिफाइन एनी नंबर ऑफ लूप्स इन साइड अनदर लूप in a nested for loop one or more statements can be included in the body of a loop in a nested for loop the number of iterations will be equal to the number of iterations in the outer loop multiplied by the number of iteration in the inner loop the syntax to use nested for loop is first of all we have to define outer for loop then inside the body of outer for loop we have to define inner for loop inner for loop is depend upon outer for loop if the test condition in inner for loop is evaluated to be true then body of inner for loop is to be executed in a inner loop when condition become false then control transfer to the body of outer loop then again check the condition for outer loop and so on let's see the example of nested for loop in c programming first of all inside the main function we have to declare two loop counter variable the first variable is for outer loop and the second variable is for inner loop i is a variable for outer loop and j is a variable for inner loop then first of all i is equal to 1 and i is less than equal to 5 and i plus plus this, this is the outer loop inside the body of outer loop apply the inner loop j is equal to 1 and j is less than equal to i and j plus plus then inside the body of inner loop display the value of i and inside the body of outer loop use slash n for new line now after the execution of this code the output is 1 then 2 2 3 3 then 4 time 4 and then 5 time 5 first of all i is equal to 1 and 1 is less than equal to 5 outer loop condition is evaluated to be true then control transfer to the inner loop now j is 1 1 is less than equal to 1 condition is evaluated to be true then print f i 1 is to be printed onto the screen then j plus plus j become 2 2 is less than equal to 1 condition is evaluated to be false then control transfer to the body of outer loop print f slash n slash n transfer the control to the new line then i plus plus increase the value of i by 1 i become 2 2 is less than equal to 5 again condition is evaluated to be true then control transfer to the inner for loop now value of j is 1 1 is less than equal to 2 condition is evaluated to be true then print f i 2 is to be printed onto the screen then j plus plus j become 2 2 is less than equal to 2 again condition become true then 2 is to be printed onto the screen then j plus plus j become 3 3 is less than equal to 2 condition is evaluated to be false then control transfer to the body of outer loop slash n 
transfer the control to the next line i plus plus i become 3 3 is less than equal to 5 condition is evaluated to be true then control transfer to the inner loop j is 1 1 is less than equal to 3 condition is evaluated to be true then print f i 3 is to be printed onto the screen then j plus plus j become 2 2 is less than equal to 3 condition become true then print f i j plus plus j become 3 3 is less than equal to 3 condition is evaluated to be true then print f i j plus plus j become 4 4 is less than equal to 3 condition is evaluated to be false then control transfer to the body of outer loop slash n transfer the control to the next line then i plus plus i become 4 4 is less than equal to 5 condition is evaluated to be true then control transfer to the inner loop j is 1 1 is less than equal to 4 condition is evaluated to be true then print f i 4 is to be printed onto the screen and so on when this condition become false when i become 5 condition is evaluated to be false then control transfer to the body of outer loop slash and transfer the control to the next line i plus plus i become 5 5 is less than equal to 5 condition become true then control transfer to the inner for loop j is 1 1 is less than equal to 5 condition is evaluated to be true then print f i 5 is to be printed onto the screen and so on when j becomes 6 6 is less than equal to 5 condition is evaluated to be false then control transfer to the body of outer loop slash and transfer the control to the next line i plus plus i becomes 6 6 is less than equal to 5 condition is evaluated to be false now in this case control transfer to the end of the program in a nested for loop, the number of iteration will be equal to the number of iteration in the outer loop multiplied by the number of iteration in the inner loop. When i is 1, this loop will work one time. When i become 2, the inner loop work two times. When i become 3, inner loop will work three times and so on. Now if you want to show output in this format 5 times 5 then 4 times 4 then 3 times 3 then 2 times 2 then 1 times 1 Now in this case first of all i is 5 and i is greater than equal to 1 and decrease the value of i by 1 This is the outer loop. I is 5 and 5 is greater than equal to 1. Condition is evaluated to be true. Then J is 1. J is less than equal to I. J is 1. 1 is less than equal to 5 condition is evaluated to be true then print f i 5 is to be printed onto the screen j plus plus j become 2 2 is less than equal to 5 again condition become true then print f i 5 is to be printed onto the screen then j plus plus j become 3 3 is less than equal to 5 condition is evaluated to be true then print f i j plus plus j become 4 condition is evaluated to be true then print f i j plus plus j become 5 5 is less than equal to 5 
अगेन कंडीशन बिकम ट्रू देन प्रिंट एफ आई जे प्लस प्लस जे बिकम सिक्स सिक्स इज लेस देन इक्वल टू फाइव कंडीशन इज अवेल्यूएटेड टू बी फॉल्स देन कंट्रोल ट्रांसफर टू दी बॉडी ऑफ आउटर लो प्रिंट एफ स्लैश एन स्लैश एन ट्रांसफर द कंट्रोल टू दी नेक्स्ट लाइन देन आई माइनस माइनस आई बिकम फोर फोर इज ग्रेटर देन इक्वल टू वन कंडीशन इज अवेल्यूएटेड टू बी ट्रू then control transfer to the inner for loop now this for loop will work four time and so on after the execution of this code output is to be printed onto the screen